Hello everyone, my name is Elfa. Welcome to Plummy Sims and welcome to today's speed build. I hope you're doing well and having such an amazing day. So today we are building in the world of Willow Creek. We're doing the Lot Park and this is the Magnolia Blossom Park and this is going to be a base game only build because I made this for my Willow Creek base game only save file that I will release real real soon because well um I kind of promised you around January that I I think I could share the save file around mid-March or around the 20th the latest uh, but in fact I was so busy since the end of February up until last week so I yeah I missed everything I didn't build anything for the past three ish weeks and that's because of the like work stuff and I'm so happy that I finally can sit down in front of my PC and build and especially catch up on everything because well I mean I I missed a lot of things especially the newest pack even though I just built um, a build or technically two builds but I just um, published just one build using the newest um, pack but that's all and actually I had like a uh, five days off um, including the weekends because I I worked all day every day for three weeks even the weekends so I think I deserve that and I decided to sit down um, and open up my game and catch up on everything because I again I missed everything and um, the first thing that I did was build using the newest pack and also kind of like finishing out all of the base game builds that I have postponed for weeks i would say and um i still have two more lots to fill and um those are community lots so we have done all of the residential builds and the left are um community lots and i think i'm going to build a wedding venue like a very fancy i'm not sure if it's going to be a fancy wedding venue or something like that but i kind of imagine it as an old city hall or like an old post office that kind of repurposed as a wedding venue and also the other one i think will be a gym slash pool area or not area but like gym or pool belt so it's kind of like a fitness center and that's basically what i thought um right now but yeah i think those are two builds that i need to do before i finish the whole save file and doing a lot of play testing and also um, putting the townies back and finally can share it with you but um, I am very excited about this save file especially because I think I found so many great base game items I discovered a lot of things doing the um, process of me building or rebuilding everything and for this build um, I decided to go with more modern looking um, park because if you've been around since my new crest save file or you know my new crest park you might be familiar with my new crest park build of course and I decided to go um, with more modern take for the park so it's kind of similar with this it kind of has the same vibe but totally different take i hope you understand but i will put the photo of my new crest park somewhere on the screen right now so you get the idea and it kind of reminds me of that park but at first i was so nervous about this build because one it's not like i built a lot of parks this is only my fourth park and it's my second big parks i would say or maybe this is the fifth one but anyway, um, the thing is, I wasn't so sure about what kind of style for this park because it's a standalone lot, so it doesn't have any uh, nearby lots. And I thought that since the original build was so good, I love it very much. 
um, I should do something totally different than that and I decided to go with more modern approach and that's why we have this and um, it took me three hours to finish the whole build which is so ridiculously long because it's only a park and it has no indoor space not as much as a real house but um, it took me forever because I was so um, unsure whether should I put a pond like a fishing spot or not because normally I will put one at least but um, on this build I put none because I realized that there are a lot of fishing spots nearby around this lot and I think it's kind of unnecessary to have another uh, fishing spot inside the lot even though I'm pretty sure um, if you put this build um, on other lots it might look a bit different the surrounding area might not have any fishing spots and that's totally normal and if you'd like to I don't know like have some fishing spots you can maybe just like do some work around and yeah I think it's totally fine to maybe like bulldoze my I don't know one of any area here to be a fishing spot or maybe you just like plop this in Willow Creek to have it like a fishing spot but yeah um that's that and by the way I am very sorry if we have a lot of background noises um that's because I got a new microphone and I'm not sure if this setting is all right and two there are a lot of people outside outside my house and um they're they're screaming each other and that's because tomorrow is the first day of Ramadan and um naturally it will be very noisy here so um yeah i hope you're okay with that and um i hope my microphone doesn't pick too much background noises off but yeah anyway we have a few sections here so the first one is the kids playground area the kids outdoor playground area the second one will be the picnic area that has some outdoor seating we have two chess tables and a game table and we have a real building area so we have a bar downstairs and a toilet or technically two toilets and upstairs we have the gardening deck and we have um, like a kids tower which is so adorable I love the kids tower and um, on the very top level we have the sky deck that has two telescopes for your sims to I don't know maybe like look up for the moons or stars or whatever and we have a kind of like a function area functional area like multi-purpose area so I kind of imagine it as a hall but outdoor if that makes sense so um, i've been very active lately um, i've been doing a lot of workout and all of them are um, like group workout and it needs to have um, like a decent size area to be able to do the workout because it's a group workout and i thought that having a kind of like a function real like a tribune or like a basically like a space for you to do workout is nice in your park especially if you have spa day and you'd like to have um, like a yoga area or I don't know like a boxing area you can put that there or basically like anything and I thought that this kind of park is really nice in real life because you have the jogging track and I lately I've been jogging a lot um, don't know why but it happens lately um, but other than that I thought that this park looks really cute with the pink trees on the back of the lot and I decided to put two more pink trees in front of the lot because I think it blends really well and it makes this magnolia blossom park really blossoming <laughs> and that's what i thought and also um we have a shower and tub combo in one of the toilets i believe so if you have um infants or toddlers here and you need to bath them um i got you covered but one thing i totally forgot to put the changing table so if you'd like to have some it's an easy fix you can just like put that in somewhere maybe um in the toilet 
but yeah that's just um that's just a little heads up on that because i know some of you might need that and yeah i think that's basically it we're we're doing the um landscaping here with the train paints and everything and we'll be heading on to the screenshots and by the way if i sound a bit too rambly that's because it's my six voiceovers i keep deleting everything because it was too noisy outside and yeah i hope this one is okay but yeah, I think that's it. Um, if you'd like to download this build, this is already available on the gallery. My ID is Elfatiera, or you can find it under the hashtag Sims. You can also click the download thing on the description box below that will bring you to my coffee ko blog post. It'll have two different links. The first one is the gallery download link, and the other one is the Trifast link from SimFastShare. So yeah, I think that's it. I really hope you find this video inspiring and the build useful to your game. And if you do, please make sure to hit the thumbs up button. Also, make sure to be subscribed to the channel if you haven't already. And if you'd like to, you can also ring the bell so you'll be notified every single time I have a new video posted. So yeah, I'm going to go now. Thank you so very much for hanging out with me today and always supporting me. I hope you have the very best day and I'll see you very soon. Bye!